Journalists from various media organizations in Edo State turned out early Wednesday to embark on a tour of government projects across the three senatorial districts of the state. But first, the chairman of the State Council of the Nigeria Union of Journalists, NUJ, Festus Alenge, speaks on the essence of the assignment, maintaining that while the union remains apolitical, the tour is to afford the journalists relevant information about ongoing and completed government projects in the state. A lot of stories we have been writing in the newsroom. Many occasions we have not had the opportunity of seeing some of these projects. So may be coming like rumor or just normal literary story. But the union felt it's proper for us to take a look at the various projects so far executed by the state government, both completed and ongoing across Edo State. The purpose for us on this visit is what we call a mark, not a mark, because we have been hearing a mark. But journalists want to do what we call a mark. Therefore, whatever story we see becomes a public story. So let us do the right thing. Like we all know, the Nigeria of journalists is a non-governmental organization. We remain apolitical. It is our responsibility to report what we see. But if there is any other one that goes the other way, we must also balance the story. The state government believes that there has been a lot of misinformation about its policies and programs peddled by people who take advantage of a democratized media. And here, the special advisor to the governor on media projects, Kruso Osagi, is confident that the project tour will help dispel unfounded speculations while setting the record straight. All kinds of stories can be told. Sometimes people just write whatever they, they feel like writing. In that regard, there's a lot of misinformation. And our our uh, profession has suffered a major hit because of that. So that's one of the reasons why we're doing that, this uh, exercise today. So that in actual fact, journalists, trained journalists, will go from project to project and see all the things that we've been doing in the state in the past five, six years. And like the chairman said, I mark these projects and then, you know, subsequently inform the public, let them know exactly what the government has been doing so that we can dispel all these uh, fake news and, uh, you know, uh, uh, the kind of press that is done just to, just to paint the government in a bad light. With that said, the journalists are set to go on a mission the council describes as uncommon in the history of the state and expected to enrich the knowledge of the citizenry. Henry Swanlele, ABS News.